Elizabeth Makowski pays for a parking spot on Clearwater Beach. It's something she's just recently began doing. Every day before work at Frenchie's Rockaway Grill, she would park right here along Poinsett Avenue. That was until a few weeks ago when she was greeted by red flags and no parking signs. So it's like, where the heck are we supposed to park? So Elizabeth contacted the city's parking department. And he said everything is going to be metered and pay stations from now on and the employees on Clearwater Beach are going to have to pay. Pay for a permit valid in three designated lots. The cost, $40 per month during the off season, $60 during peak season. $40 a month, you know, I'm barely even making that right now, a shift. The parking fund is what we use to support the lifeguards, so 365 days of lifeguards is paid for by the parking fund. This parking lot up Bay Esplanada, about a block from the main strip, is one of the lots where employees can purchase a permit to park. But one thing they point out is this sentence at the bottom of the rules and regulations, which reads the parking permit does not guarantee a parking space. So therefore, if this lot is full, they'd have to find somewhere else to park. And that permit they purchase doesn't work in any other lot. You know, I've got just 107 on this page alone. On Thursday, Elizabeth will present the city council with a petition. Her goal? I would like there to be a major decre decrease in the decal uh, a month for the employees to pay. An idea the city seems to already be pondering. You know, maybe the permit fee needs to be looked at. Maybe the uh, location where they park needs to be looked at. And just maybe a compromise can be reached that works for both the city and employees. Jason Beisel, ABC Action News.